It's a surreal kind of day. Join me after the intro, where we'll get deep into these juices. We'll vape them, and I'll come back and give my thoughts. Catch you in a mo. Welcome back guys, it's Danny from Home Demon Vapes uh, coming at you with another juice review. Today we've got some surreal vapes. They are 50ml short fill zero nicotine. Um, little backstory, if you go back through my channel you'll see that I did a surreal vapes video a long time ago. Uh, that was back when he just used to make juice for himself, for himself and his friends. Uh, a guy called Yaya, brilliant guy. Uh, I finally got to meet him at the expo just gone. Um, and when I used to buy the juice off him all that time ago, he had a certain flavour called Blue Mist that I really enjoyed. Um, but he kind of put it to the back burner because he had uh, a lot of things going on that he needed to sort out. And then he decided to come back with a bang and go TPD ready. Uh, and he used to do the free 10ml bottles in a box for, uh, for TPD. And he did uh, a number of flavours. Um, Black Mist and Stremonade being two of them. Um, but I was highly disappointed when I found that he decided not to put Blue Mist through TPD. Uh, however, when I met him at the expo, he decided to tell me that he's now re-released Blue Mist. So if you ever had Surreal Vapes way back in the day and loved Blue Mist, and then found out he got rid of it, uh, so you you got all pissy. Well, now you'll be pleased to know that you can go and get it again. Uh, as I say, <clears throat> fifty mil short fill. Uh, I'm not entirely sure whether he sells these with the Nick shot. Uh, at the expo, I got them with the Nick Nicks, um, but I don't know whether he did that just because he knew me or whether that's standard procedure. Uh, so I've got two of the Surreal Vape uh, juices to review today, one being Black Mist and we're going to do a rerun of Blue Mist just to see if it still tastes the same as it did back then. Uh, on the bottles you've got your usual, um, the pro this product is not for food and it's to only be used with e-cigarettes. Then you've got other warnings such as keep away from your four year old sticky fingers, um, don't stick it in your dog's water bowl and definitely don't vape any of it if you're kindly giving your baby some milk from your bubble arms. Um, so with that being said, let's vape some shit. So for this review i have got a Paldico red rogue with a uf1 trinity glass gripper up top uh i have some 0.11 mech aliens from the one and only matt coils uh link in the description to his instagram freshly whipped used in cotton candy uh i've never used cotton candy before before the expo, however, I got uh, I got a packet from expo, so I'm quite enjoying it. And then we have the Smock Rainbow Tea Priv with the Rainbow TFV12 with a fresh coil that I half filled with blue mist just to bed in the coil. Uh, so I will now fill up the rest of this. And we shall vape. 
I really hope that you enjoy the reviews guys. Um, I'm by no means new to YouTube, uh, but I am new to YouTube through vaping. So if you've got any ideas on what I could do, then hit me up in the comment section below. Or if you've got anything in particular that you'd like to see, let me know. Or if not, if you just enjoy the videos, hit the like and subscribe button, yo. To get my mod cloth, I've spilt a little bit of liquid. Right, so. Smock t priv TFE12. 95 watts. Let's go. As I say, this is blue mist that I'm vaping, which is that one. It certainly pops out clouds for um, a 70-30 mix, 70VG, 30VG. What I will say is, I only added half of one mix shot to this, uh, so that's going to make it around 1.5 milligram on the nicotine grand scale of things. But, it tastes exactly the same as what it used to, which I'm really happy about. Um, a minty, menthol kind of flavour on the inhale. It's not cool order, because as far as I'm aware, cool order is flavourless, but this does have a flavour to it. Uh, I'm leaning more towards menthol. It's not too menthol, it is subtle. But there is a taste there, and then on the exhale, it's just straight blueberry, no messing around. But, I really like it. I've liked it right from the start. I liked it back then, and I still like it now. So... With that being said, we'll switch up devices and we'll try a bit of Black Mist, shall we? Uh, just from the name Black Mist, I'm guessing that it's going to be a black currant menthol, purely because Blue Mist is a blueberry menthol. But I'm sure we'll find out right now if I can get the lid off. Ooh. The initial smell is really strong. Black, black currant. It is black currant. Does it have the menthol in it? You would think so. Considering its older brother, Blue Mist, does. Obviously, I said that it's older brother uh, because Blue Mist has been around a lot longer than Black Mist. So, we're just juicing up this US 1 by Trinity Glass. Excellent dripper, uh, if you're into drippers. It's a velocity style build deck with very nice deep juice wells, guys. Nice and easy to drip on, and nice and easy to uh, coil up and work with. This is getting there. Ooh. Gotta love them matte coils. Get my gold top cap and slider on. Open up my airflow. Got wide open airflow. If the camera will focus on my powder coat red rogue. Let's go. Well, 
I don't know whether that's supposed to happen. Um, initial thoughts. Extremely throaty. Extremely throaty. Um, but before slamming your yaw for it being uh, throaty, that could actually be my fault. I did expo Friday to Sunday. I was absolutely knackered. My initial guess is I'd already put uh, a nick shot in it and then forgot and then put another nick, no, nick shot in it. So by my own right, I have probably made this six milligram. Not to worry, won't go to waste. Uh, my partner vapes six milligram, so she'll like that. But for the sake of the review, I shall try and get through it. Ooh, dripping a six milligram is harsh. Right. It's black current without a shadow of a doubt. No menthol though. Which is strange. I was really expecting menthol or at least a cold hit. Uh, I'm not getting that at all from this. I'm just getting a straight, um, almost soda like black current. Um. It's actually really bloody nice. I'm blowing puny clouds because I can't take a full-on lung hit off it. But no, uh, I digress. Black mist, straight black current, uh, almost soda slash cordial type black current. Um, if you get a, a black current cordial and don't dilute it with water so it's nice and strong, that's what this vape is going to give you. Black Mist from Surreal Vapes. A really good juice, guys. A really good juice. Now, to tell you where to get it from. I've currently got up the greyhaze.co.uk website. And they've got all of the flavours. I am in talks with Yaya at the moment to try and get the rest of his flavours in. So that I can give a review on that. Before I get any further into this, you will probably hear a lot of really loud bangs going on um, outside. My office is situated in the front of the house and we've just suddenly had a huge firework display kick off. It was supposed to have gone off at half past seven, but it's now eight o'clock, so it's half an hour late. Apologies if the noise comes through into the camera. Uh, but yeah, the other flavours, uh, aside blue and black mist, you have caramello, you have raspberry swirl, and you have strawberry shake. And he also has another separate juice line called Glazier, and I've got some of those juices to review for you guys uh, in a future video. So, without further ado, I will let you go. Links will be in the description below for the Surreal Vapes Instagram, the Matt Coyle's Instagram, my own Instagram, and the Grey Haze website to where you can buy this from. So, I bid you all farewell. Have a nice evening. Don't be a dickhead, and I'll see you again soon. Ta-ra!